<laughs> Check out this Chevelle. Uh, awesome, Chad. <laughs> this thing is awesome. How's it going, Will? Hey, Ron. Love the green paint on this thing. I got a wider angle view, folks. It's awesome. New iPhone 11 Pro Max. Hopefully, we get some good shots for you. Check out the vet. The glue in rear windows. Good morning, Kevin. It's green. The Chevelle's green. Some some kind of green, right? <laughs> It's dark. Looks good though. In my opinion, it needs the bumpers back. It needs the bumpers back. But it looks awesome otherwise. I like the way they did the rear window on this thing too. Um, I forgot the name of their shop. Hold on, I'll find out for you. Excuse me, fellas. I don't want to scratch your car. <laughs> There's a lot of people around this car right now. I'll try to check it out. Celebrity cars seems to be back in the house with their Porsche. Folks, let me know how bad the wind is blowing today. This is my first time using this camera phone. I do not know if it picks up the wind like the other one did. Let's get a better look at the vet. Look at that vet, it's nice. Thanks, Ron. Oh, yeah, that's a beauty. Oh, missed the bug rolling in. You can hear the wind. Good. I mean, not good. As long as it's not staticky. This was at Meekum, I guess. Forgot the name of their shop. It's a hot rod shop. <coughs> Here, it's on his shirt. Look, see, look at his shirt. That's the name of the shop that built the ride. <laughs> yeah, nostalgia hot rods. Oh, well, check it out. Dodge. Good old Dodge. There's Jerry. Say good morning, Jerry. <laughs> Ryan's back. All right. 
it's kind of a lot of randomness today. Let's go roam around. It's a Mustang crowd. Look, it's Scott. I actually like that one. I like that one, but the interior of this black one here has got that red shifter knob. Did you see the Chevelle and the Vet that bolded? No. They're nice. Nostalgia hot rod cars. Nice. nice. Yeah, it's packed again. And we're gloomy today. Yesterday was 106 degrees. Look at this. It's breezy, chilly, shady. Don't get me wrong, I'm not complaining, I like it. Hey, pilot. I do like the wide angle view that this camera gets. I don't gotta step away so far back. Don't gotta step so far back. And uh, hey, how's it going? Thanks for subscribing. That blue. I like the Lambo. We got the other Dodge here today. Sorry, folks, if the wind is messing with this audio. I like it. Patina, patina. It's all the rage today. COVID-19 safe. <laughs> Awesome. Yeah, there's some Porsches here. We'll check them out. Look, I used to say coroner on there. <laughs> That'd be kind of cool. That was the city coroner's car. Rodney, good morning, or good afternoon to you. It's just after 8 a.m. here in Vegas. David, how's it going? Those kind of things, for me, I just want to be reliable. If I went to California or something, I don't know. What's up, what's up? Hey, Kenny, how you doing? All right. A little much on the yellow, but yeah, I like it. That's Eric, Diesel Media Garage. He, he, he does a lot of stuff with these big rigs right here and diesel powered stuff. He has a magazine. It's the guy that brought me to SEMA this year or last year or whatever the hell was the last one that passed. Any 510 fans in the house? This one's set up pretty good. Mordor. Overpowered little lightweight car. Awesomeness. Look at the size of that turbo on there. Oh man, missed the Yanko Nova rollout. Bummed. Let's see, maybe we can catch them rolling out here in the street. I don't know if 
he's leaving or if he's just moving. No, he's, he's moving. Yanko. Too bad he left. Bummer. Check out the goat. Hola, Juan. Good morning. See what kind of RC she's got. She's been rolling around all morning. She's been playing with those all morning. We got a, I don't know how to say either one of those words, but there you go. Looks like a moog or a mog or whatever the hell they call those. And then it's a little Nissan, is that a Figaro import? It's like a 91, 92. These are hot little imports right now. All over YouTube. I like the top. It's a right hand driver, too. New T-Bird. It's a Nissan. It's a Nissan. Japanese Nissan import. What do they call it? I think it's on the... Figaro. It's a Figaro. Or Figaro. I don't know how to pronounce it. <laughs> and we got the, the new vets here today again. If anybody still hasn't seen one yet, that's the 2020 vet. From Ohio. Hey, Joe Chin, how's it going? Dee Dee, good morning. Yeah, I didn't think I needed a second. Thanks, Chris. Yeah, it's the minute the stuff started getting back up and running, you gotta be here. You never know what you're gonna miss. Never know what you're gonna miss. Got Beretta, Beretta and his cockatoo here. <laughs> Morning, Stuart. Ferrari. SS Nova. See, she got her other RC car out she's playing with now. melting some plastic. Somebody got some melted plastic on their exhaust or something. Wow, cruiser.
What happened, Christopher? Good morning. Hope everybody's Saturday's going well so far. How do you like the color on that? Here's the car, here's the class, here's the pillow. <laughs> it's all right. None of us can spell, it's all right. It's 2020, we're all illiterate. <laughs> White Nova. We'll work our way around since we missed the Yanko. We're still got ways to go in here. Good old Ford truck. It's a nice K5 Blazer coming in. Well, oh, he's way down there. See, we got like four or five aisles going that way. Actually, four aisles going that way. This aisle, this aisle, and all those over there. I don't know about that yellow. It's from Colorado. Colorado drive through in the house. Some Dodge guys. Yeah, it was a little windier earlier. It's just breezy now. Tomorrow should be really nice weather. Here we got a pair of modern day bullets. Cool. I'll be there. I'll be there early. Like that Jeep. Everybody just hanging out. I don't have any lights on my VW. I still gotta figure out what the hell's going on with that. It's gonna be another month or so probably before I can have that out maybe I don't know DMV still ain't open yet either hey breezy Whew. here come the wind how about this orange folks you like the bright orange hey old coins Nice blue Chevy. Oh yeah, we'll get over there. The more door fifty seven. It's gorgeous. Yeah, I like them without the post. Uh, nobody's man making it mandatory yet. No. It's your option. There's a few people masked up here, but not very many. I just stay, stay my distance. Nice old vet there. Or new vet. Beautiful Packard. Hi, Kenny. Hey, hey. Make sure you go to Roger Files and check out all the cool stuff he's got on there. If you don't, you're missing out. Totally. Look at that. Pardon me while I step in a 
<laughs> 71. I got a, I got two 72s that I'm trying to work on. It's been all updated and it's got. Man. There go Tom. He's bailing. He's leaving us to go work at the car museum, the Hollywood Car Museum out here in Vegas. If you ever want to check it out, hit me up. We'll get you in there. It's an awesome little car he got. Yep, I'll see you. Look at that. It's a great ride. There's a gasser. Seventy three, why a seventy three? Just out of curiosity, I think seventy three had them gas shock front bumpers. Didn't really like that one too much, but personally, I'd like to have anywhere from a sixty to sixty seven, sixty all the way up to sixty nine. I haven't seen this blue and white one here before. That's pretty, pretty nice. It's a Mercury Comet. Oh yeah, this is a Mercury Comet. Very nice. That'd be like what, 61 to 63 ish. Let's go around and check out the back side. No, they're getting harder and harder to get. I remember back when I was in high school, they were a dime a dozen. You could pick them up for just a hundred bucks or 50 bucks, a couple hundred bucks. Now you can't even get a runner for a thousand. It's hard. Yeah, that's a nice little comment. It's a five point oh turbo coupe T Bird. got mods on him but he's got it so nice it's like showroom fresh like showroom fresh yeah I bet send me some parts <laughs> Probably cost a fortune. That's a nice one. Love that orange. Not Stacy Abrams. No, she's out. The top six. Oh, Anybody got any cruises set up in their area yet? Like I said uh, last week, Arizona had some stuff set up and California's been getting back to it. They're checking out the engine and the Chevelle. But he'll cut it off now, of course. <laughs> Uh, white Nova. You guys wanted to see the White Nova?
No. Not a requirement yet. Hey, Chevy Napco. What's up, Bruce? What do you guys see Bruce's truck when he finally gets that thing running out here? That Chevy Napco. Woo! That thing is badass. The SSC upholstery. And it's a six speed, six speed manual. Wow. Bet you this thing kicks ass. Can't get around that side. It's my favorite Porsche right there. Not that color, but that body style. The four door. Huh. Morning, morning. Love doggies around this morning too. Awesome. Comes a Buick. The Buick fans in the house. Comes a nice old Buick. That Wildcat. Oh no, that's a 225 Electra. Big body. Yeah, the Panorama is my favorite. I like it. It's sickening, but I like it. <laughs> Look at all the dogs today. Yeah, I have a, I have a 67 C10, and I, I, I don't want to like it. How's it going? It's another one. Yeah, I've always loved them. It's another vet. Bye. Take it easy, old coins, if you're leaving. Um, it's going to be in the 80s today. Right now it feels pretty cool. It's probably high 70s right at the moment. Like I said, the sun is trying to come out here, but we got a little bit of gloomy skies, a little bit of breeze. Then we got this Porsche. He passed me on the freeway this morning. that weird science Porsche, right? <laughs> From the weird science movie. Another nice Nova. Got a cage. Ooh, Christopher, you rock. Thank you.
like it. No, I hate jacket weather. Just t-shirt and shorts is all you need out here. Mm -hmm. All right, let's go to the next aisle. <laughs> you rock, Christopher. Thanks for the donations. If anybody else wants to donate, the button's there. <laughs> There's an awesome T-Bird. Where's another Porsche? I gotta go check it out because it is one of the ones that I like. So. Panorama Turbo. Got a fair lane. We had a couple of cobalts here today too. I told you I go all over the place. Check out the big Dodge. Big Dodge with stacks. Nice Chevy truck. So is everybody going to tune in tomorrow at 8 a.m. for Rancho and Craig? The weather is supposed to be awesome tomorrow. It's not supposed to be windy at all. So they say. Was that Cadillac that came rolling in? It's got a nice seat upholstery. Check out this 1963 Cloud Rolls Royce. Look at this sucker. What beauty. You can smell the leather outside this thing. Used to have a 69 four door Cadillac. Still used to ride like a dream. It was a tank though. There's James Corvette. <laughs> Pretty slick blue bit. <laughs> Belvedere. Mopar time. Let's see what he's got under the hood. Three eighteen. Three eighteen air conditioned car. And that's a 
pound, though. Yeah, that's my favorite color on this Impala right here. I like these. Believe it or not, this one is a 56,000 original mile car with one repaint <laughs> one repaint but it's all original the rest of it's all original fifty six thousand miles There's some TNA for you. Two of the most oddest colors that they have, I guess. Look at that bright yellow and electric blue. 6.6. .6. Oh yeah. 57 sounds pretty good. BW. It's got a turbo. Some big Mickey Thompsons on the back. I think I shared this one before. Looks like he's got some new add-ons on the engine. Like it. It's more original, more original stuff. Check out Woody. It's a fee, right? Five bucks, two, five bucks. No, I don't. I don't think that would have worked. <laughs> I don't think yellow would have been good for the camera anyway. Remember that we had that in the cougar? Oh. Look at that. Yeah, <laughs> he probably would have quit. He probably would have quit, that's for sure. He could smell the wood, it's nice. The jump seats. Look at the VW guys leaving. Yeah. 
Everybody's always sporting wood, oh yeah. Sounds pretty good. Not gonna lie, not a fan of that one. Not a fan. Yeah, I don't know about that for too much. There you go, you get to hear your little white Nova. Truck is awesome. There's that Fairlane 500. Pretty slick ride. Is there anything else you guys saw at the corner of your eye you'd like me to go check out? Let's go see what this Porsche was. See if he's got any badges on the back. That's a 928S4. It's too chilly out here for him. Or I'd say too early. Too early for them to be out? I don't know. This is more of the older crowd. With a little bit of this and a little bit of that thrown in here and there. It's an awesome spot, folks. If you ever get a chance, come on out. Las Vegas when you're in town, 9500 Eastern Avenue every Saturday from 7 a.m. to 10 a.m. Every Saturday, unless it's raining, of course, or the winds are blowing over 30 miles an hour. Just check out some randomness. You're welcome, David. Thank you for coming out. Thank you all for coming out. Woo. I can't keep up with the little cars. Best burnout of the day. <laughs> we got a mini car show. Slippery one. Oh, that you like that body style? I don't like that body style. 
I, I don't like that body style of Mustang, and no, I don't see any here. This is one of my least favorite Mustangs. Oh, we had some VWs actually show up. Let's go see, and then we have the Corvair too. We have the Mordor Corvair. Sitting on the fat white walls. With the smallest Corvair engine they ever made. It's probably like 76 horsepower Corvair. Yes, I like the Fox body. I like the Fox bodies and then from there I like uh, like 73 and older from there on. And then the very newest ones. Yeah, it goes over the engine. Passenger side over the engine on the Corvair. It's best though if you put it in the trunk. There's a Grand National. Yeah, it helps the weight balance of the Corvair if you actually put it in the trunk or the frunk. There's your wagon leaving. Dodge wagons bailing. Hell of a cruiser. I'm still playing with the RC cars. There's a course for you. Oh, Gold Nova. He's out of here. All right, back to the VW. <laughs> Convertible Camaro. Oh, there goes the bugs leaving. There it goes. Sounds good though. You get to hear it at least. All right, man. Enjoy. Catch a big one. Catch a big one. Let's go check out the double cab. Mike's car almost done? I thought you guys were doing this one. <laughs> it looks good though, I like the little bomber style. Yeah, we got the dash uh, instrument cluster back in, the glove box back in. What street is this warehouse on? Is it by the Hustler Club over there? I think it's like yeah, around the block from the Hustler Club. There. It's I gotta come and get some video, you guys. Across from the studio, uh, the stadium. Oh, uh, okay. Go, taking Russell West, make a left on uh, the, the street, okay. same street that the I, stadium's I know that. on. <laughs> Can't think of the name of it. And then you make the next left. That's a Quindo. A Quindo. Okay. So, it, uh, so you make a left there and then make a quick right. I'm gonna have to try and come by sometime this week. The, yeah, we've we've been over there working almost every day. He's there every day. I've been there most days. I'm going to get some video of that car before he puts it out to the public. <laughs> yeah, it's, uh, it's looking pretty good. It's, it's coming along. All right, man. I'll catch up with you. All right. Take Enjoy care. that car. Stop by. Yep. Look at that steering wheel. That's nice. This is a race, race double cab, I guess. See, the back of the new Mustang looks all right. He don't have his deck lid open, but look at that. He's got carbon fiber bumpers. I know. Original's nice. Original's nice, but custom is cool, too. As long as you're not screwing up an original. Mm -hmm. See him roll out in the Corvair. What do we got? A little Nissan. 
Anybody like the Zed cars? How about the, the growler, the prowler? <laughs> Boo. <laughs> All right. How about the Viper? Prowler's kind of cool, man. It was a good idea. I don't know how well they executed it, but it was a good idea. Definitely looks better without the factory bumpers on it. That's for sure. Here you get to see what a Lotus Lotus looks like right next to the Viper. Ooh, they're so similar, not. <laughs> there go the Corvair. Better shot of the judge. Yeah, by Corvair and the Noble. Thanks, Randy. I appreciate that. Vernon, when are you bringing out your car? How about all blacked out, vet? All blacked out. Got the maroon interior, maroon and black. Looks kind of nice. Good color combo. Man, see? I didn't even see the guy with the new vet leave. You go down an aisle and people disappear. All right. I guess it's gonna be an eargasm coming to your coming for your pleasure. All the Mustangs are leaving. I do like the sounds of the Mustangs. They would do too much damage to their car if they tried to hit me. <laughs> Trust me. It's a spectacle. Gray color. That black and red. Oh. Ooh, I don't like that sound though. Ooh. See, that's why I don't want one of those. Ooh. The Borla exhaust sounds Ew. good on the Mustang. Sorry, if you got recorded that. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I get it. For the record, that sounds. I don't like. like I don't like the clattering either. I like a throaty sound. So. Exactly. anybody else rolling out still got lots of cars here <laughs> yeah weirdos pulling out in the mustangs uh can't can't be around the crowd He didn't leave. He was just rolling around the park lot. And here we got this dual turbo Cadillac. Dual turbo Cadillac. That's fucking awesome. Look at that. Uh, Torino. Or uh, Fairlane 500. I hope the audio comes out as good as it sounds to me out here, folks, for you guys. Man, I don't know what he's burning in there, but it smells good. 
sound like he almost stalled it. it smelled pretty good though. Back to the dual turbo Cadillac. Woo! Look at that sucker. <laughs> you next? <laughs> Say he's next. <laughs> He's got all ass. We got a Ferrari coming in, another Ferrari. Ford Lightning taking a hike. There you go. I like when they start pulling out and they leave. They're rolling around. It's like action shot. <laughs> Does it? That's what I try to get, you know. Park cars are okay, they let you walk around and let you see the interior and stuff, but I'd rather hear it. I'd rather hear it driving by. I'm glad you agree. Very nice interior on this car. The sucker's low too, bagged. bagged with a hell of a power plant there i'm sorry folks it's just coming all over the place there's that little nissan i could tell you it's a lot easier to make the drive-by videos when I'm not live. It's live, I can't predict. I don't know when the hell they're gonna roll out or when they're gonna roll in. We just gotta take our chances. And when I do my pre-recorded videos, I stand out here for like four and a half hours and I get like uh, half an hour of footage of the good stuff, just the roll-by stuff. And bullet. Bullet Mustang leaving. That convertible Camaro over there is pretty nice too. I do love that green. That's an awesome green on that car. else leaving it's a better shot of the Ford truck I know we got some truck fans in the house that likes all the old classic trucks I like them all folks there might be a car here or there that I make fun of because well they're they leave it open for you to make fun of like that thing right there there's a, this is one of your SN Mustang, isn't it? I don't know, is that an SN Mustang? I don't know. But that's one of the body styles and I'm not really liking. Blacked out vet. <laughs> the little cars are always so much louder right always so much louder all right look at that it's beauty look at how wide them tires are
like the canvas top. Canvas top looks really nice. Very nice job they did on this one. <laughs> How about the maroon on the on the Mopar over here? It's a nice color, 392 Hemi. Oh yeah. I had to get a little closer up. Look at this Jeep. Oh yeah, that makes the Jeep that much better right there, that V8. Sounds good too. Okay, lots of folks leaving. It's time to go. I've been on for over an hour. See y'all tomorrow, eight o'clock, Vegas time. Thanks again for coming out. Thanks again for all the comments. Y'all the rock, best viewers ever. Thank you.